हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस चैप्टर नाइन मेटल्स एंड नॉन मेटल्स द स्पेसिफिक ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ टूडेज क्लास इज यूज ऑफ मेटल्स नॉन मेटल्स एंड मेटलॉइड्स इन द प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अक्रेंस ऑफ मेटल्स एंड प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ मेटल्स एंड नॉन मेटल्स फर्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस वॉट आर द वेरियस यूज ऑफ मेटल्स एल्यूमिनियम स्टूडेंट्स एल्यूमिनियम मेटल इज वेरी लाइट वेट मेटल इट हैज अ लो डेंसिटी एंड डज नॉट इजली करोड प्योर एल्यूमिनियम इज वीक एंड सॉफ्ट दैट्स वाई सम अलॉयज ऑफ एल्यूमिनियम लाइक ड्यूरेलोमिन एंड मैग्नेलियम आर यूज फॉर मेकिंग एयरक्राफ्ट फ्रेम्स students aluminium is a good conductor of electricity so it is used for making high voltage wires now gold metal students gold is highly malleable resistance to corrosion and chemically very stable it is used for making jewelry because of its shiny luster Gold is used by dentist for filling cavities in teeth. Now mercury metal mercury is a liquid metal and expands a lot on heating. Students mercury is used in making thermometers, barometers and other scientific apparatus. It is used in fluorescent lamps and batteries. Next copper metal Copper is a red orange metal which is soft enough to pull easily into wires or press into sheets. It is a very good conductor of heat. Students, copper can be drawn into very thin wires. It is also used in lightning conductors, hot water cylinders and copper bottomed pans. Next metal is iron. students iron is a hard substance that can be shaped to make a wide variety of strong hard objects it can decompose into flakes or rust students cast iron used to make utility hole covers iron combined with carbon to make steel cutlery and car bodies now zinc metal Zinc is a brittle blue white metal which does not corrode in the air. Students, rusting of iron can be prevented with zinc by the process of galvanization. Zinc is also used in making some cells to generate electricity. Now we will discuss magnesium metal. Students, magnesium metal is used in fireworks. because it burns with a dazzling white flame students magnesium is also used in cam and mobile phone bodies alloyed wheel gear box housing in the vw pesset magnesium side panels and aerospace applications now students we will discuss uses of non metals first nitrogen students nitrogen is found to an extent of 70% in the atmosphere nitrogen is used in industries for the production of ammonia which is an important ingredient of fertilizers we use in agricultural fields now oxygen non metal oxygen is used for breathing students oxygen is life supporting gas and is helpful in respiration of plants and animals it is added to air through the process of photosynthesis and oxygen also supports combustion next chlorine chlorine is used for purifying water students chlorine is added in water to kill the germs by the process of chlorination now uses of iodine non metal iodine is used widely as an antiseptic which prevents the growth of microorganisms and 
used mainly to clean cuts and wounds students iodine is also used for making antibacterial gurgles which helps in preventing throat infection now we will discuss uses of noble gases students noble gases like argon xenon etc are used in all kinds of colorful displays where glowing signs are utilized for advertisement purposes light bulbs filled with neon argon krypton are also made use for producing laser beams students the krypton neon gases are used in filling night club bulbs to provide sparkling colored bulbs for theaters and night clubs students helium noble gas is used widely in all kinds of scientific research where the inert gas is made use of for specific environment helium is used by meteorology department for weather balloons now students we will discuss the various uses of metalloids metalloids can have properties of both metals and non metals students silicon is a metalloid silicon is brittle like a non metal but can conduct electricity like a metal Silicon is found in computer chips, glass and sand. Silicon is also used in solar panels and electrical devices. Students, silicon is used in computer parts and is alloyed with iron for electrical steel and aluminum for automotive parts. Next, metalloid is arsenic. Students arsenic is commonly used to strengthen the alloy of copper and lead which are used in car batteries Students arsenic is alloyed with lead in car batteries and with germanium for high speed integrated circuits and LEDs Now antimony Antimony is used as a fining agent which helps in removing microscopic bubbles from TV screens. Students, antimony is used as its oxide as a flame retardant is alloyed with lead in car batteries and with silicon in circuits. Next, germanium. Students, germanium is used in solar panels to increase efficiency. Germanium is used in optic fibers as its oxide germania is alloyed with silver for tarnish resistance sterling silver and with silicon for high speed integrated circuits Now students open your chemistry book page number 131 common uses of metals first uses of gold it is highly malleable resistant to corrosion and chemically very stable it is used for making jewelry because of its shiny luster it is used by dentist for filling cavities in teeth next uses of copper copper is highly ductile and good conductor of heat and electricity copper can be drawn into very thin wires because it is a good conductor of electricity It is used for making utensils because it is non-reactive and does not attack food acids. Next, uses of magnesium. Magnesium is very ductile, malleable and the lightest of the commonly used metals. It is used in fireworks because it burns with the dazzling white flame. It is used in the preparation of alloys such as duralumin and magnesium because it imparts high tensile strength. Magnesium alloys resist corrosion and therefore are used to line water pipes and tanks. Uses of zinc. Zinc is chemically reactive and brittle metal but at ordinary temperatures. It is little affected by air or moisture. It is used in dry cells because of its electropositive nature. Rusting of iron can be prevented with zinc by the process of galvanization. Uses of mercury. 
Mercury is a liquid metal and expands a lot on heating. It is used in making thermometers, barometers and other scientific apparatus. The solution of a metal in mercury is called amalgam. For example, silver amalgam and gold amalgam. This amalgam is also used by dentist for filling tooth cavities. Uses of aluminium Aluminium is the most abundant metal and second most useful metal after iron in the earth's crust. It is a good conductor of electricity, so it is used for making high voltage wires. Thin foil of aluminium is used for packing food materials because of its light weight and high malleability. Some alloys of aluminium like duralumin and magnesium are very lightweight but very tough. These are used for making aircraft frames. Uses of iron. Iron is used for casting and in railing because cast iron expands on cooling and can be easily molded. It used for making tools, warship etc. because in the form of steel it has high tensile strength. Now common non-metals oxygen. Oxygen is found to an extent of 21% in atmosphere. It is life supporting gas and is helpful in respiration of plants and animals. It helps in combustion. It is added to air through the process of photosynthesis. Nitrogen. Nitrogen is found to an extent of 70% in the atmosphere. It is an inert gas and slows down the process of respiration and combustion. This gas helps in the formation of plant and animal protein. Chlorine. Chlorine is a greenish yellow gas. It is used for manufacturing various chemicals. Next, iodine. Iodine is a violet solid. It is capable of sublimating and turns quickly into vapors. Next, helium. It is a second lightest gas. It is used for filling in weather forecasting balloons as it does not support combustion. And the last is argon. It is an inert gas and is used for filling electric bulbs. A small quantity of mercury and argon are used in fluorescent lamps. Now students, you must be able to do the name the following of page number 135. Thank you.